Today marks 25 years since the death of Mobile Police Corporal Owen McClinton. A hit and run driver crashed into his patrol motorcycle as he was responding to a call in Midtown Mobile. WKRG News 5's Chad Petrie takes you back to that day and tells you how the family is keeping McClinton's memory alive. Mike McClinton says he carries this binder with him all the time a collection of images and remembrances to his brother Owen. 25 years ago, he says he got the call that changed their lives. Shock and disbelief at first. Because, I mean, I kept saying, is she sure it's Owen? Is she sure it's Owen? Is she positive that it's Owen? Owen McClinton was heading to a traffic assignment on his police motorcycle when he was hit and killed by a vehicle at the intersection of Government and Mohawk Streets. I know he loved his motorcycle. I know he loved being a police officer, and I know he loved being a motor officer. Mike McClinton says as part of his efforts to try to keep his brother's memory alive is to show support for law enforcement wherever he can. I just don't want people to forget any of these officers that have been killed or, or, or seriously hurt in the line of duty. Uh, you need to keep them in your prayers every single day, seven days a week, not just when something tragic happens, and, and that's, that's all I would ask. Whether it's the specialty made black and blue bottles of water or his brother's call numbers on the front of his car, Mike McClinton always has his brother on his mind. Three years ago, he stood along the procession route for fallen officer Justin Billa, showing his support. He worries these stories can fade away, and he wants his brother's memory to not be forgotten. Chad Petrie, WKRG News 5.